Right, I'm on the Tirfes, I've got loads of time ahead of me and I thought I'd give you a little bit of a uh, breakdown as to how altitude affects uh, temperatures. Um, basically, every, as you go up in altitude, the air gets thinner. And because it's thinner, it can't hold as many gases uh, as it can further down uh, the valleys. Uh, and because there's less gases, it can't trap quite so much heat or hold so much heat. And the temperatures tend to drop by about one degree, a rough rule of thumb, by about one degree per 100 meters. Um, so at the minute in France, we're having a bit of a um, heat wave to the point where uh, I'm about uh, I'm near I'm about 2,400 meters altitude here, and temperatures are about 11 degrees. Uh, it's mental. Um, if you go further down in uh, 1650, which is the main resort uh, where I'm staying, uh, you, uh, the temperatures there are about 16, 17. Um, and as you go down the valley, my parents are coming up today, uh, down the valley near Lyon, it's about 25, 26. It's incredibly warm in France, so that's because there's a bit of a uh, uh, hot tropical or tropical continental air mass coming from uh, northern Africa, warming up uh, and the, uh, warming up southern France and the Alps. Uh, not at all the case in the UK. I hear you guys have been having a horrible wind, uh, so good luck with that. I'm not going to lie, I'm loving uh, being in this climate.